Yo, what's good everyone and in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a modded for the color after the latest patch of 1.68. Before we do get into the video, shout out to these three people right here on the screen for subscribing to the channel and let's get straight into it. So I'll be showing you guys the new gen method first and then I'll show you guys the old gen method right after this. So for the new gen method, you will need to complete the Heyo's time trial, which if you guys haven't done that already, you will need to make your way up to the HSW marker on the map. And it is up just by the city and kind of by the casino, just across the road from the casino. You guys want to beat the Heyo time trial, which takes you about eight minutes or like around seven something minutes to do. And once you guys do that, you will unlock the chameleon colors. So this is for new gen consoles only and for the new gen version of GTA. You want to go to the LS Customs, go to Colors, and you will see that the Chameleon option is available. Now, these are all the Chameleon colors right here, and they are basically modded colors which are only exclusive to New Gen. So, you guys can get these, and they are sort of like a 4D looking, cool looking color, you know, very, very cool paint jobs that you guys can purchase. And two of them are actually free. So, the red one and the dark purple are actually free, which is pretty cool, and yeah. Now, as you guys might have noticed, this is actually the car that is in the thumbnail of today's video. So, as you guys can see, it is the chameleon color, the red chameleon color, and it does look pretty sick. But let's go ahead and move on to the next method for old gen. Before we continue on with the video, if you guys don't want to spend hours grinding out these glitches, be sure to check out Charlie Smurfing. They provide multiple services such as modded accounts as well as money and RP rank boost for all platforms. They also offer their instant delivery feature. There will be a link in the pinned comment and description and be sure to use code itschar for 5% off your order. Now to start off with the modded color method on old gen, you guys will need to make your way to LS Customs or wherever you guys want to customize your vehicle. I'm going to be customizing mine inside of my arena workshop, but it really is up to you guys. Now the only requirements for this is to unlock the chrome color. And if you don't have chrome unlocked, what you guys can do is you guys can go to your auto shop if you have one and the auto shop unlocks everything for you so you don't actually need to what do you call it unlock chrome or anything like that you can just go to your auto shop and it will automatically unlock it for you only if you are buying it from that place so yeah if you go to customize your vehicle in the auto shop you can unlock everything for free once you guys have basically got chrome unlocked and you guys actually do need to be in a crew as well for the crew color to come in what you guys want to do is you guys want to go ahead and customize your vehicle. So to start off with the customization, you want to go to the primary and secondary colors and set them both to chrome. As you guys can see, I'm setting them both to chrome right here. And it obviously just looks like chrome right now. But once we do add in the crew color, this is where it's about to look cool. So make sure both your primary and secondary are set to chrome. And once you guys have done this, go ahead and select crew color on both of those primary and secondary. As you guys can see, we've already got a cool looking red chrome color, but that is not all. So once you guys have equipped the crew color onto your chrome, obviously the crew, whatever crew you guys are in is going to be the color that you guys get. For my crew, or well, it's not actually my crew, it's a random crew that I joined, but it is a sort of just red color. It's not really anything crazy, but it is a red color. And yeah, what you guys want to do is obviously equip your crew color. If you want to join my crew, I'll leave the link down in the description. It might possibly be full though, but you could always have a try and see if you can join up on my crew and I have a modded color in there as well. Anyways, once you guys have the crew color on the chrome, you guys can go do per lesson and equip a per lesson if you guys want to make it look a little bit better. So I did equip Torino Red, I'm pretty sure, but it don't, I don't really think it made that much of a difference. But yeah, per lesson, you can chuck a per lesson on and uh, make it look a little bit better. Anyways, you guys are now basically done with the modded 4D color. Now, if you guys want to make it look a little bit better, there's another method that you guys can do, and that is by doing this exact same method. But before you guys equip the chrome, you guys want to put the brushed steel on both of your primary and secondaries before you guys do it. So right here, as you can see, brush steel, equip the first one, and then equip it for your secondary as well, and then put the chrome on, and then the crew color, and then, you know, the pearl lesson if you guys want to. So boom, put the chrome. And what this kind of does is it adds a bit of a silvery tint to it, I think. It might make it look a little bit better. It's really it's really like up to you guys. It might honestly not even make that much of a difference. But I feel like it makes it look a little, uh, little bit better. As you guys can see, this is the finished product. I'm going to drive it outside so you guys can see it. And since it is snowy right now in GTA, you can't really see how the color pops out. 
but it does look pretty nice still nonetheless as you guys can see it does look pretty sick and this is what you guys can get now obviously it's not going to be red for you guys or it might be but you know you just use your crew color whatever crew color you guys have you can get that color and that is how you guys get a cool modded 4d color in gta 5 online hopefully you did enjoy and if you did drop a like and hopefully you have a great christmas and a good new year all that sort of stuff appreciate you all and i'll see you in my next one man let's get it chat appreciate you man let's go